Yes, we're in the tasting room. And for you hop heads, you're going to be in heaven today. Now, I'm not talking IPAs or double IPAs, though those are down the road. I'm just talking two pale ales. But oh my goodness, are they hopped heavily. I think you might like them, you hop heads. <laughs> Our first one is from the Joseph James Brewing Company. This is out of Henderson, Nevada. And for all you who have little geography problems, Southern Nevada, even a little lower south than Las Vegas. Well, this was started in 2006, so this is a fairly new company. And it was started by uh, Matthew Lasowski. And we just want to say, Matthew Lasowski and Company. His dad helped him, but he doesn't like to have his name in the press. Well, I had a delightful time on the phone with him. They want to make great beers, because great beers make great microbreweries. They also want to educate everybody about great beers can even come out of Nevada. And being a Nevadan myself, I know that's a fact. So let's get started with this one. This is called a Tahoe Blue. Pale Ale. It has got a 6.2 alcohol content. Whoa! It has got a 65 IBUs. And if I could pour a beer decently, we wouldn't have such a problem. Excuse me for the burps, but let's keep going. This is a this is a lovely smelling beer, and obviously I can smell it well because I've basically spread it all over. <laughs> they use Cascade and Centennial hops in this beer. And look at this, it's a beautiful colored beer. You know, when you think of pale ale, you think of really almost a real light, light, light. But this is more of a pretty amber. And I'm going to fight my way through this head. Yeah, I know. Mmm. Mmm. Tell you, the hops are magnificent. You hop heads are truly going to love this beer. Now, let me get to the beer. Mmm, mm-hmm. Mmm, mmm. Oh. This is, again, for you hop heads, you're gonna find this beer delicious. I think the color's wonderful, the mouthfeel is delightful, and the hops, well, let me tell you, the hops are just magnificent. You love hops? You're gonna love trying this beer. I know it's available in Probably eight to ten states. Boy, I wish all great beer was available everywhere. But give this one a try. Mm-hmm. I think you're going to like it. Well, our next one. Southern California Stone Brewing Company. This was started by Greg Koch and a Stephen Wagner in 1996. Now listen to these numbers. These guys, as with so many of the microbreweries, they start out small. So in 96, granted, it's only the last few months of 96, but they basically brewed only 400 barrels of beer. Well, they not only have a brewery, but they have a magnificent eatery. Look at the taps that this place has. It just knocks me out. This is what we need in our own homebrew areas. Well, let me tell you, in 2009, these guys did 98,500 barrels. I hope you heard that number. Delightful place. The gardens are gorgeous. I think this would be a wonderful place just to spend a, a beer man's holiday. Let's get a taste on this one. Their pale ale. It has got a 5.4 alcohol content, 41 IBU. Their hops are Magnum, primarily, I'm trying not to let it get away from me, 
an autonym. Now, autonym I've not heard of, but, ooh, this has got a beautiful, beautiful aroma to it. Mm-hmm. The beer is gorgeous. Again, not a real pale ale. It's more of a, an amber ale. Let's try this. Mm. Mm. Okay. Oh my. This is also a hophead's heaven. You guys who are really into the major hops, this is hop, hop, hop. A little sweeter than the Tahoe Blue, but the hops are really, really nice. I think investigation of hops is something that would be exciting. There's so many varieties out there, we should be exploring all the different ones and what they can do for us. Well, this is a lovely beer. Mm. Oh, sitting in their gardens, sipping this. Oh, what an afternoon. All right. For you hop heads out there, you're not going to go wrong on either one of these beers. They are delicious. I'm going to give them a rating of two thumbs up each. Great beers. I think you're going to like them. And I'm excited about trying other beers from both of these breweries.